Okay, I'm mixing up some colors here. I know it's kind of orangey, but um, normally I just have brown in a tube, like a burnt sienna. But I just use yellow and red and black to get this sort of brown color. I'm looking over my shoulder a little bit because I've got a picture of rope behind me. Um, all right, and I'm just gonna see what happens if I add a little blue. Which blue was that? I think that's my uh, ultramarine blue. That can give it a little tint as well. And um, I already sketched this out for you. So uh, we have these shapes here. Now, I'm just, uh, I need a little water. All right, so right now I'm just blocking in this as an underpainting. I'm using this flat brush. Ideally, I think a, a round would be better. So let me get rid of that and uh, swap that out. So, so I kind of mix it in there and twirl it a little to get that point. Now I'm back in here. These are not really super high quality brushes. See how it's pulling apart like that? So I'm scrapping that one too. Okay, this one might be better. Need a little bit more paint, grab a little yellow, a little bit of that cadmium red, a little water, and some of this black. Let's get to that brown again. And back to the drawing. So that batch was just a little bit darker and I have a little piece of fuzz on the tip of this. That was causing a problem, so I got that out. So right now I'm going to go down and I'm going to block all this in. Mix a little bit more water in there, stretch this paint out a little bit. So now we have that basic shape of the rope. I don't know if yours is smaller than this, but I tried to draw, I tried to guess at what size your rope was. Okay, so you, I think that you get the idea now. So let's just stop the video for a sec.